what is up guys welcome back to the channel again welcome back to the vlog it's a beautiful day out and the day has finally come i am so happy to tell you guys that i finally got my first sponsor um it's not it's not a big deal it's a little product that they sent me so i can you know do a review on it and show you guys and give you guys my opinion as well and obviously i'm gonna link down the description so if you guys are interested you guys can buy it as well so with all that said i hope you guys are doing good and let's start this vlog guys so before i continue the video i want to give a special thanks to sandra for getting in contact with me for letting me work with their team let me tell you that i had a sneak peek of your product and it looks amazing I, I can't i can't wait to show you guys what the product looks like thank you sandra so let's start with this black box um this makes the product feel a hundred times better because it's not the same receiving um any product in a black box you know a nice looking box than in just a regular brown ugly box. My opinion towards that. So a huge uh, shout out for the black box. That looks, that makes everything looks, that makes everything look a lot better. So, all right guys, I got the XPCTD um, headlights. Yes, that's what they sent me. They sent me a pair of headlights for the truck. These are the five by seven. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe that these are your low beams in the bottom and your high beams will be in the middle. My first reaction to these when I saw them, guys, these things, they feel amazing. I'm talking about amazing. They feel real good. Just the way they look and the way they feel, you can tell that they are not your regular $20 headlights or whatever you want to call that, you know? They feel, they, they just feel, you know, I don't... I, I don't I'm speechless I really don't know what to tell you they, they feel so good and the way they're you know they're sealed and everything there's you can tell there's no garb everything looks perfect and that I love about you know when I'm when I'm when I buy something I always make sure that I'm buying um you know it's, it's worth my money you know so if this is something you guys are going to be interested in I'm going to leave the description down below so you guys can take a look of other product they also have different sizes not only this size they have different sizes for multiple vehicles so something very important this is dot approved i don't know if you guys can see it there but it is dot approved and something that i like even more is that the black housing is painted it's not flat black you know it's painted like a shiny black looks real real clean it makes the whole light look amazing to be honest and looking at you know looking at, at it good I don't see no damage areas nowhere everything looks to be perfect these are led lights i have one three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven three six seven eight nine ten eleven led leds inside this light you know how it's gonna light up the light it look, it's gonna look like daytime i drive a lot at night time and that is very important for me to have a good visibility you know up front obviously right okay something else that i do like is that they send uh, an extra harness just in case your truck or your car whatever you're going to be using this on um, is wired in a different way if it is all you really have to do is move your pins you know you take the cable off from here you move your pins around obviously your low beam with your low beam your high beam with your high beam your ground with your ground and the whole nine yards and that should make the light work so like i said guys these things feel amazing they look amazing and all i can tell you is let's install them and let's wait let's wait till it gets dark so i can turn the lights on and show you how they illuminate the night so let's get to that so it's funny guys because um i actually have a cracked light that just happened of, of a week ago or something like that um i guess a rock hit me here and you know it busted my light um so let's start taking this apart it's a few bolts here I'm not sure if this comes out with the housing as well down there or if it's just these four bolts. Let me take this out and let's see what happens.
Look how nasty this is. Look how dirty that gets. Down there. Even the LED strip down here, look how dirty it gets. I'm gonna be cleaning all that out. I'm missing a boat here. You guys can see it there okay so the middle section remember i have section the bottom i have the top section the middle section is your low beam and then your high beam is when the top and the bottom turns on so like i said the top and the bottom and then your the top and the bottom are your high beam and your middle section is the low beam i thought it was the other way around i thought that it was your low beam the top and the bottom and then your middle will be your high beam but anyhow now going back to the other thing that i told you about the plug I was correct on that this is just right now so you can see what it looks like i have to fix everything obviously i have to change up uh the way the plug works in order for it so i can have in order for me to have low beam and high beam if not i would only have high beam so i'm gonna throw on my high beam now so you can see what it looks like Okay, see how everything's lit up? Bottom as well, I just don't want to touch it a lot because I don't want it, I don't want the whole thing to fall. So that's lit up, which is my high beam. This is my low beam, and then the bottom section right there. I don't know if you guys can see it down there, that's lit up too. So, like I said, now that I found the way my plugs go, let me make sure I don't make a mistake and I don't burn up a fuse or I don't burn up a wire. So let me put everything back together and I'll show you guys how I'm going to do that. Okay, so now that we have everything working, see, like I said, these are your low beams with these, and then this is your high, no, I'm sorry, these are your low beams down here in the middle, and then when you hit your high beams, all this turns on. Make sure when you're going to put them in, 
you have where is it at okay dot okay so they go this way so you have all these in the bottom and you have only these on top okay make sure you put your plug in correctly when you plug everything up make sure that you have nothing let me see something so the only thing i am going to be doing that i see here is for this not to open up see how it's opening up a little bit i'm gonna do some electrical tape just so i can make sure the water does not go inside That should keep uh, moisture and water from coming in some more. So, um, it should look something like that. All right, guys. So um, the bottom is off, as you can. I don't know if you guys can tell there, but the bottom is off. And you're gonna have the top one on, and then you have uh, the top one off as well. You only have the middle ones on, which is the low beam. Look what it looks like. That's the low beam. Let me show you over on the other side. That's the low beam right there. I, I do have to regulate them a little bit so I could lower them a little bit because you see the, the front of the truck is completely dark. I mean, not too, too much, but it shouldn't be so dark in the front of the truck like that. Um, all I have to do is maybe lower them, I don't know, maybe a couple of turns in the actual light and that should do the job. Now, I'm gonna turn on the high beam for you. Give me one second, I'll show you. So that's the high beam. So you can see the high beam um, travels further the high beam travels a lot further. Sorry, I know it's not that dark here. I would have to try them on the highway um, where it's really dark in order to, you know, um, give you guys an exact, an exact accurate, um, you know, feeling about the lights. But from what I'm looking at, from what I'm looking at, um, they're good. I totally recommend them. Plus, they look super, super, super good in the truck. Look at that that black face well you can't see it now but yep let me show you I got a glare in the camera some more glare so yeah
one more time I'm going to show you the high beam so you can see what it looks like So check out how much light it's on me. It actually bothers me a bit. So I wanna take a quick second and thank Sandra one more time for reaching out, for sending me the lights. I love them. The quality on them, it's perfect. They're sealed completely. Water should not be able, water should not be able to get inside of them. Um, they look amazing. Guys, if you guys, are, you guys are interested in picking up a set like these, Sandra told me, she didn't tell me a pricing, but Sandra told me that they are super, super affordable. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a description down where you can find these lights or you can find other models that they also have. With all that said, I hope you guys are doing good. Peace and keep on trucking.